Alrighty, hello guys, so can be faces back to another Simple Planes video. It's been a little while since we've actually played this game, but today we have an F4E Phantom 2 Doomsday Nuke. So this thing actually has a nuclear missile slash bomb uh, equipped to it, and we are going to be destroying, I guess, the entire fleet with this bomb because, yeah, I don't really know what else to target. So, let's go ahead and take off, fly over to the fleet, drop our, our nuke, and, uh... Yeah, I guess we'll see if we can get away from it, because it might destroy us too. Anyway, let's get on with it, shall we? Hey! Okie dokie, let's go ahead and floor it. There we go, that is pretty awesome. Let's go ahead and, uh, is this trim or is this... Oh, there we go, there's our flaps right there. Let's go ahead and get ourselves into the sky. And lift our landing gear up. Okay, maze balls. Yes. All right. Nice. Look at the exhaust on that. It's so. It's black. It's very black. Anyway, we're in the sky. That's pretty awesome. Uh, we're gonna fly in a straight line. It's where we actually have interceptor missiles. We also have four guardians, and then we've got the 100 kiloton bomb or the 100 kiloton missile, and then we've got cannons. Amazing. Okie dokie, so there is actually a few things that we do need to do. We need to go ahead and release this. There we go, that's awesome. Uh, we will actually go to here and connect to the air to ground. There we go. And we'll go for the missile one. I don't know whether that's a good idea or not, but whatever, that's fine. Uh, afterburner is one, so we can actually go a little bit faster. Whoa, look at those rings light up. That's cool. That's actually really, really cool. And there's our target right there. USS Beast, let's go ahead and lock on. Launch our missile, there we go, and get out of here. We need to bug out. We actually need to fly away, because it is going to do so much damage. I'm going to turn the afterburner off, and we're going to turn this off, so we can actually see it. There it is right there. It is about to hit the target in three, two, one. Okay, I don't actually know whether it is, because I can't see it, but it's over there, don't you worry. Whoa, my god, okay, there we go. There's the nuke, it's gone off. I don't know whether it's going to kill me, but maybe. <laughs> and there we go. We've actually destroyed the entire fleet just like that. That's insane. That is actually insane. I didn't even hear a boom. Wow. All right. Well, I guess we'll fly back over and we'll see what the damage was. I would assume that there is quite a lot of damage on this thing. Uh, I'm not going to lie. It is... Uh, I mean, that was a massive explosion. That was actually ginormous. But anyway, let's fly over and we'll see what the damage was. Okie dokie, let's go ahead and turn off the afterburners, and there it is right there. The destroyers have already sank, and the uh, the aircraft carrier is currently sinking. Amazing, that is, that is crazy. Okie dokie, since we actually have more weaponry left, we're going to go ahead and take out the USS Tiny with cannons, uh, and then if we have any air-to-air -air things to take out, we'll go ahead and take those guys out too. Alrighty, here we go. Who's that coming over the hill? Is it a monster? Is it a monster? It's me. It's me, guys. It's me. All right, here we go. Let's line ourselves up a little bit better than this. All right, turn ourselves to the side and line ourselves up on the USS Tiny and utterly obliterate it. Die, USS Tiny, die. Is it dead yet? I, I have a feeling that I am hitting it. Oh, there we go. It's dead. It is dead. Amaze balls. Yes. Yes, die a bit more. Yeah, amazing. Woo! That's pretty awesome, actually. All right, Edsware, is there anything in the sky that we need to take out? I don't think there is. Okay, well, let's do a landing then instead. Okie dokie. So we can actually land on aircraft carriers if we want to, but we do not currently want to. Uh, if I press A, we actually have uh, nav lights and stuff. We don't need to do that right now. Landing is going to come down, even though we're going 300 miles an hour still. Uh, that is completely fine. Lower this down as well. That's awesome. And will be good. AG3, 4, and 5 all say open. I'm not sure what that means. I don't know what that means. So we go ahead and just leave that alone for now. But anyway, we're going 240 miles now. Let's go ahead and see if we can land it uh, at 240, 50 miles an hour. Here we go. The angle of this approach is awful. That's okay. Here we go. Lift us up. Okay, and we are down. We are down in DD, and we've landed. Amazing. Yeah, you know what? That totally worked. Okay, but that ain't it. We're going to go ahead and take off again, and we are actually going to try and take out air targets this time. And then once we've done that, we'll go ahead and try and nuke something again, because 
Why not? All right, here we go. We're in the sky. We are flying. Afterburner is on. Let's go vertical, and we'll head towards the World War II fleet. Let's do it. Oh, wait, guys. Look at that. We actually have a target in there. That right there is actually the convoy, uh, and in order to take out the whole convoy, we're going to go ahead and get a little bit higher. Oh, wait. The World War II destroyers are right there as well. Okay, well, we can take those guys out after. But anyway, let's go ahead and try and drop the bomb inside that little area right there. You guys can see them. There we go. And we'll drop it right there. That's fine. And we'll fly away. <laughs> We're going to get away as quickly as we possibly can because we are so close this time. We are so, so close. Oh, my God. Okay. Wait, that's it? Wait, it didn't work this time. It didn't actually do it. No. What the heck? It didn't actually do it. That sucks. That sucks so much. It should have exploded, like, big time. It should have exploded big time, but it just didn't. That's really sad. Okay, well, anyway, let's just go ahead and do a, uh, a bombing run. Sorry, a gunning run, I should say, of these guys. Okay, right, that was the worst. That was the worst run I've ever done. Let's go back around and try again. Okay, here we go. Let's go ahead and get over this. Whoa, just like so. Okay. Amazing. There we go. We have lined them up perfectly here, I think. So we're going to go... Oh, we're going to get locked onto. That's fine. That's fine. Slow down. All right, we missed all of them. We are getting shot. That's not amazing. We didn't miss all of them, but we missed a lot. I should have slowed down way earlier. Okie dokie, coming back in for another run. Let's go ahead and see if we can kill them this time. All right, we've slowed all the way down this time. There we go. We're going to give us enough time to actually shoot these guys. There we go. Maze balls. Whoa, that was close. There we go. God, I blew myself up. There is literally only two trucks remaining, though. All right, next time, we're going to go blow up the World War II fleet. Let's do it. Okay, afterburner on, there we go, lift up the landing gear, turn ourselves around straight away, and we're gonna go ahead and destroy them in, like, one shot, that's all it takes. It's just one shot, we got this. I'm gonna climb quite high as well, there we go, that's pretty awesome. Uh, and then any second now, we should get sight of the fleet, which is out here somewhere, there they are. Okie dokie, lock onto the destroyer, tiny two, there we go. Alright, so the nuke is going in. We're also gonna fly in with it. Uh, and hopefully we don't die straight away, but we are getting flacked, interestingly enough. I kind of want to do a mission where I, I fly into the flag. I really do. Okay, but anyway, the nuke is going in. Let's go ahead and turn ourselves away now. There we go, just a little bit. Turn this off. And... Oh yeah, it blew us up too. That is a nuke. That is a nuke and a half, guys. Hot diggity dog. Amazing. But yeah, it blew up the whole fleet. Good. Okie dokie. So just because I want to actually attempt to uh, see how this works, uh, the bomb didn't work last time because it doesn't actually work the way that you would think, I don't believe. We're going to put our afterburner on. We're going to try and drop the nuke so that it actually goes straight in the volcano. So let's press to now. There we go. Wait, no, it just drops it. Wait, it drops it with a parachute. That's really weird. Okay, we're getting out of here as quickly as we possibly can. Oh my lordy. Oh my lordy, that's not amazing. That is not amazing. Okay, but if it works, it works, right? So let's see, let's see, let's see. Okay, let's turn the afterburners off. Okay, it currently hasn't exploded. But it will, don't you worry. Okay, will it? I don't even... Oh, yep, yeah, it exploded. Jeez Louise. It actually took out everything, like the bridges and everything. Hot diggity dog. Amazing. Yeah, look at that. The bridge is dead. The bridge is actually dead. I wonder if the bridge down here died. It did. Look at that. The amount of damage on that thing is insane. It blew up the bridge over here too. Wow. Wow, wow, wee, wow, wow. That's crazy. Okay, so there's one last thing to try. We are actually going to go ahead and fly this plane straight into the USS Beast. Uh, actually, we're going to try and land with our nuke on board. Uh, and we'll see if we can actually do it without exploding. I don't know. It seems like the risks are pretty high there. So, you guys might want to see it. Yeah, let's try it. Okie dokie, while we are actually flying towards our death, I just wanted to say if you guys do actually enjoy Simple Planes videos and you guys want to see more, maybe consider subscribing. Also, if you guys really like this video, leave a like on the video down below as well. It'll help me out a lot and it'll help me know whether you guys want to see more of these videos. But anyway, let's go ahead and attempt our landing, shall we? 
Okay, okay. We're gonna go ahead and turn off the afterburner now, and we are gonna get ready to actually land. We're gonna turn our throttle down to what, like 30%. We're gonna go ahead and drop this guy down as well, which is our flaps, and we're also gonna drop our landing gear down at 600 miles an hour. Just makes sense, right? It makes no sense at all, but whatever. That's okay. All right, very cool. So we're gonna slow down massively, which is awesome. The landing hook itself is on seven, so we'll go ahead and drop that down as well. Amazing, and we've got a landing chute on six. Okay, we won't need that today, but uh, yeah, this is gonna be great. It's gonna be fine, don't worry. Okay, so when you land on an aircraft carrier, what you wanna do is you wanna make sure you're at 90 degrees. Uh, and just before anyone comments down below that that is a silly idea, I know it is. I'm telling, I'm, I'm telling jokes and also lies. But anyway, this is the worst way of going in for a landing, and um, we're doing it anyway. So, yeah, happy birthday to me, I guess. Oogie doogie. Okay, there we go. Pull up, pull up, pull up. Catch a hook. I missed all of the hooks, but we were very close. All right, retreat, retreat. I'm just extremely wary of the fact that I do have a nuke on the bottom of this thing, and uh, that is, it's on my mind a little bit, I'm not gonna lie. So we're going in again, and this time we are gonna try and slap ourselves onto the ground a little bit more aggressively. Here we go. There we go, we caught the hook, and we are off the edge of the carrier. Oh, no! Oh, wait, wait, wait a minute. What is going on here? All right, landing gear come up. There we go, maze balls. Can we actually take off again? Okay, we are actually, okay, right, fine. Since I can't actually land, we're gonna go ahead and turn ourselves around. Okie dokie, one second. Oh, oh, that's, I don't know if that's gonna land properly. I think that's gonna go underneath the water. Yeah, that's not gonna work, is it? Also, where are the air targets? There just doesn't seem to be any. That's really weird. But there it is. Our nuke just went into the water. Bloop. Amazing. Right, now, I actually have a good chance of landing, right? Do I? Do I even? Because I'm, I'm coming in at the wrong angle completely. Like, yeah, the wrong angle completely. What is wrong with me? Jesus, that was close. That was very close. Okie dokie, turn us back around, there we go, landing gear down, that's awesome, and let's land it, we got this guys, this time we totally have this. Also if I press V, look at that, amazing, that actually looks fantastic, it looks so cool. Anyway, we're going in for a landing this time, we are not lined up very well at all, but we are still going 190, which is perfect though, it's actually a pretty decent speed for this landing, uh, and we're just going to go ahead and plop it down and hope for the best. Okay, this time... Smells like a good landing, actually. This time it totally smells like we have a good chance at landing. All right, there we go. Easy peasy. Very nice. Well, um, yeah. Anyway, I think what I'm going to do uh, for the final thing, we're going to take off once more, and we're going to fly straight into a hill. Yeah. Now, you might be thinking that's a really silly idea, but um, I want to see what it looks like. So let's go ahead and get rid of our stuff. There we go. Full afterburners. Go ahead and get rid of the landing gear. And we'll fly straight into this mountain right here. Here we go, ready? And woohoo! There we go, nukes away! That's amazing! Okay, I didn't expect the nuke to go off, but this is going to be the end of the video. Fade to white, amazing. Uh, and I guess I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye!